Welcome back everyone, this is Momi CX Ren, and today we're gonna do chapter 30. Now, before I start chapter 30, I will talk about Nazarene skills and show skills that I forgot to do in the last video. Now, for Nazarene, uh, her character skill that she has, I mentioned before, this was, um, she gets plus 10% more damage in either her regular attack or normal attack. Uh, I'll talk about her next one. Her next one is uh, this skill. Rather, all her Sainshins will be uh, usable by 90%. So, remember right now, this is the original cost. All the Sainshins cost for her right now will be 90% instead, if you had this skill on. So, it's not that worth it for <laughs> the first free default skills, to be honest. But. Maybe she gets better Seishins when she levels up higher, I guess? So, yeah. Now for show on the other hand... Besides the 15% more points, she has... Um, this ability instead where... If she's at 120 power or over, her final damage will be... Uh, mod will be a modifier of 1.1 instead, so... 10% more damage. But I'll keep show for the 15% more points instead. And for, let's see, she needs MP Saver, that's for sure. Don't like how her moves are, or rather her melee and her best move is actually MP usage. So MP Saver for her. Other moves, does she need what? Let's see. Saint Genius Luck, Sure Hit, Invincible. I guess not. I, yeah, that should be it, I guess. Nazarene, I will not bother, so that'll be it for her. Just get some items to show before I start the next map. Actually, no way. Give. Go, Lily White. Uh, nah, she doesn't need anything. It's okay. All right, now let's start chapter thirty. Alright, now for today, for the uh, character selection, you'll notice that Sunny Milk, Luna Child, Star Sapphire, and Lily White are permanent uh, additions to this map. So, 
you had to use them. <laughs> Even if you don't like them anyway. So for regular style. Let's see. Kainé of course. I would say yes. Makos and maybe. Yeah, let's put Mako on just in case. Shizu. Uh, yeah, I'll just put Shizuha and Minoriko together. Deli no. Nazarene's a no, but I'll, today I'll bring Sho because I forgot to show all her moves in the last episode as well. Sane is a no. But yes. Oh, yes. And who's this? Oh, it's Hina. Okay. Um, no Hina, but I still have. Let's. Oh, Komachi, yes. That means one final member today. Who should I bring? Nah. Marisa. Nah. Uh, Nitori? No. I guess I'll bring back Sakia then. And for today, uh, yeah, put the supporters in the back. Don't want them in the front lines yet. Now we look at the map today, we have a bunch of fairies, some spirits, and uh, red kodamas. They're, they're new. Alright, so that's the case. Alright, Ramus sitting on the very left. And the others around the north. Yeah, that should be it. This will be good. And Lily White is very happy. Or it's due to the fact that it's spring right here in the sky. And our free usual bosses today is the Prism Reaver Sisters. Alright, today's condition is destroy any, or rather defeat any one of the Prism River sisters. The losing condition is that Sunny Milk, Luna Child, or Star Sapphire has to die. And for the WP bonus, Lunasa, Merlin, and Lyrica, their HP must be lowered in 50% each of them to get the WP bonus. No time limit this time, so it's very easy to get this. Take your time. And click save right here first. Yeah, uh, since Lily White did yell earlier, so she starts out with 110 power. And she has a new skill now, character skill. But before I go into that, I will show you something right now. Lily White's music changed, so it's because she's happy now. So different music, also her stats changed too. For character skill, or no wait, for uh, character stats right now, her terrain, sky is still the same, but night changed to an A, and ground changed to a B, and water changed to a C. So she sort of got a mini upgrade. Her armor increased by 350, and her mobility uh, increased by I think uh, 10 I guess or so and she also get plus one movement as well her, uh, her healing skills stay the same of course but she got two skills instead 
uh, Gutsy Dodge, and uh, this one would be Empowering Termination. And her character skill is very unique. For each turn, those who surround Lily White in 8 spaces, they recover 10 HP. Mini regen factory, so yeah. <laughs> and her tackle got about, I think, 300 points upgrade, I guess. And she got two new moves, one map weapon, and this other attack. We never know what it is yet. Actually, I might as well show it off while I'm at it. And now I'll just reload from there. But as usual, don't let them get to the front lines. <laughs> oh no wait, who has scan? Oh, Star Sapper has scan, okay. Oops, forgot to scan Lyrica. Lunasa I already talked about in the previous maps when we saw her, but I'll talk about Merlin instead. Her terrains are she's good in sky and night, she's bad in ground and water, she's a size L, uh, she, her armor is average, and her ability is okay-ish, not that great, but I guess she can get hit more. Her skills is that, um, this is called, what was it, drunk with? No, it's tipsy, tipsy, and support attack level 2. Her saying she means is sure hit, less. Yell and trust. Her attacks, uh, we'll see them later on. Now for Lyrica, her terrains are sky and night is A, is okay. Ground and water, they're bad, but it's, do it's better than others. Her size is small, her armor is bad, and her mobility is greater. Than her other sister, Merlin. Hmm, okay. Her movement six, but we don't need to know about that. She has support attack level one, and also this would be empowering. She also has empowering termination. That's interesting. Okay. These two you'll see later on. Let's see. Wait. She's small. Lyrica small. Lunasa isn't medium and Merlin's a large? That's weird. Oh well. Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, that's right. As before, okay, go right here. Actually, wait, Letty is 24, Kaine is 28. Okay, Kaine should not get any kills now. She just only acts as... Yeah. Okay, she acts as the e EXP giver. Wow, these spirits are really tanky. Oh, spirit large, okay. Despite being a large, I thought they would be more dangerous, but I guess not.
Yeah. Rain will be superior in this battle for sure. Yes, it's pretty simple now since you can just walk into the enemies real slowly to kill them off. Kill the regular Kadamas. They're useless. Let's see. Uh, okay, defense is okay, so just only the dodge rates goes down. Hmm. What can you do? 26. Huh? Hmm. 39, 11 kills for Komachi, 18, Letty needs a lot. Alright, we'll play like that then. It's okay. Honey can move a little bit forward, so it should be around. Yeah, around. No, no, wait. Maybe around here, yeah. Close range wise. The spirits are not to be afraid of because all they have is a maximum range of two. So if you're right here, then they can only hit up to here. Everyone else, once they're stuck at inside this range, these two, they're the blind spots, then you're safe. Letty learns Flash? That is strange. Directed down attacks me. All right, let's do it. Also, he has new moves compared to their regular Kadamas. I guess that could be original for laser eye beams.
That's pretty fast for the Damakus from the Prison River Sisters. Except Lunasa. Really? So they had to put this out. Alright, I'll explain here. For the enemy's turn, each turn that passes, they get plus four power. So, yeah, you could, it could get really ugly. They have other skills that give them superpowers of sorts. But it's okay for now. They don't, they're not that dangerous. They got nothing to worry about. Uh, but they also have plus 10, plus 15% accuracy as well. Only for their side. So, who gives that out? Yeah, Lyrica gives that out. Merlin, on the other hand, gives out the plus 4 power to their side of the field. Lunasa didn't put hers out because I'm not close enough, so it's okay. Oh yeah, take out the... Uh, no, 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 no. Before that... The Red Kudama has a laser and something tactical. Okay. Whoa. Oh, this is weak? Well, it only has free. <laughs> That's funny. Show sure enough? Okay, good. I wish that spear attack was a dynamic kill for show. It would have been more awesome, but uh, what can you do? Let's see, gets more damage. Hmm. I guess so. Yeah. Clearing out all the enemies is okay. Let's see, 23. Letty has enough power, that's good enough. So it's Komachi and Momiji. Yeah, they need power instead. Oh, whoops, I forgot to turn the animation off. kick this guy. Yunasa still didn't put her out. Okay, good. Uh, these things are fine. Now it's time to kill. Oh no wait. Komachi can move up to here. Okay. Momiji up to here. Good. Komachi later on in the future. I need Momiji for 
that pace. Hmm, got a bomb. Well, uh, no wait, wrong one. You can sort of make the game a little bit easier, but it doesn't really make it that easy. You can just level up, uh, it involves Ko uh, Komaku, Lily White, and Daiose, the three of them together. As long as Daiose supports attacks for either Lily White or Kom uh, Kokuma, then you can start the sort of an infinite loop of healing each other for Lily White and Daiose and Koma, uh, Kokuma to whatever level you want because as long as those three are alive constantly you, then you can pretty much get as much levels as they want from there. Heck, you can even get them to level 30... was it the highest you can get to 35 or 40 in this in this game? Yeah, you can do, probably do it in this stage or in the next stage. The ones that don't have a time limit. Hmm. Oh. What does the tackle look like from the red Kodamas? I don't want to hit them yet. I just want to hit them with just a kick. Also, this stage is so sort of one your chance to hear the themes made by Merlin and Lyrica because if you don't hear them uh, from this stage, then you won't get to hear them again because all their themes are different from each other. Oh, uh, slightly, just the arrangements. Still didn't put it up? That's strange. I hope it's not bugged. <laughs> That'd be weird. Yeah, as usual, let- Ah, oh, I forgot to let- Ugh. Oh, let Komachi get the kill instead. Twenty-nine, 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 and Rain is twenty-nine. Well...
That's interesting. Hmm. Now, how do I get them low enough to kill all three of them at the same time? Here's one thing. If you kill one of them, uh, an event will happen that will cause the other two to not be able to be get... Uh, sorry. If you kill one of them, the other, the other two cannot be killed. Oh no, don't use that. <laughs> Whoops, forgot that. Wait, how come Merlin doesn't attack me? Before I continue on, let's take a look. Okay, good. If Rainbow was about to level, I had to stop. <laughs> that would be bad. Wait, how much does Bomb do? I'm kind of curious now. Okay, let's take a look. Save already. Bomb. 3,300. 3,000. Okay. I got an idea. Somewhat. Hope it works. This attack, interesting. Okay. Merlin only used. Oh, she only used these two. Okay. What about. Oh, she... can she use that one? Ah, uh, we can't see this one. Drat. Well, that sucks. Yeah, we can't see it. That sucks. Wait, isn't the bomb... One, two, three, space? Alright, then I guess it is impossible then. You can't kill all three of them. You can only kill two of them at least. Well, that'd be nice if you can kill three of them though. Ugh. Drat. And here I was hoping to kill three of them at once with the bomb. Wait, maybe I. C Wait, if I stay here, maybe it's possible. Yeah, I'll try it again later. Her maximum space is six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Have everyone around here then. Might as well move these fairies closer. It's fancy seal? No. Kick. And we got the WP bonus. That's great. Yeah, 
Yeah, I guess I could kill three of them then. Interesting. Keyboard. want to see how much points I would get, to be honest. If I get crappy points, then I might not kill them. All three at the same time, just maybe one. And the screen went dark again, I can't believe it. Ugh. This time. Quick save first, then do. No, wait, let remove. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I forgot to bring Kurumi in the battle. Ah, oh well. It's okay. Bomb. Dead. Dead. Fifteen grays, huh? All right, so I get fifteen. What happens if I kill them individually then? All right, this that's the bomb version. Then I'll show you how much I get when I kill. Actually, I'll do it here. How much money I get from killing each of these units, or rather, the Prison Rivers? One by one. I'll start with Lyrica, and then I work my way up to Merlin. Thirteen points. Thirteen thousand points. Okay. That's Lyrica. Now for Lunasa. Fourteen thousand points. And finally Merlin. Grays versus points. Okay, kill Merlin. Kill Merlin. Alright. I'll kill her. She gives the most points, so I might as well do it.
here's the reason why I mentioned the three of them, uh, if you kill one of them, the other two disappears because they fuse into one unit and their spell card is combined uh, version of... Uh, I wouldn't say combined version, but it's just their combination spell card. And also... Where's this? Oh yeah, scan. The text right here, so... Oh. Wait, why did you move? I don't know. I can see them already. Okay. Well, here's the thing. Once they fused, they start at 130 power, and their HP and MP is refilled to the max. But they have the they have the item now that gives you. Once you start a map, you get plus 10 power. So if you wear this in every map, then 110 power each time. Their terrains. All A's now, their size is large because they fuse together, the armor is average, and durability is average. And for the character skills, I would say that they it only goes for the first person in front of the rope. So if Lunasa is in front, basically for them, then she's leader, then it'll take her skills instead for support attack, support defense, and the MP saver. Everything else doesn't matter. These two it won't take effect unless they're in front of the uh, combination of the unit. And the two attacks right here. We might be able to see the range 6 if I stay far enough. And let's see, Damaku Barrier is... I think under, uh, under turn days that they come out is that they start at 125 power instead. As for wait, how the heck did Lyrica's? Oh no no no! Okay, I get it now. Okay, uh, this part is only they start at 25 uh, 25 power at the start of the map or chapter. This one is plus 15 percent accuracy, and the heavy Damaku barrier right here that's negative 71 defense. It has Lunasas. If you're in the field, then you lose power by four every turn if you're in this area. Thankfully, I'm not, so it's good enough. Okay, who should go in front now? I should kill them fast. Six, so it's around here. Okay, good enough. Eh, good enough. Attack Remu. That's okay. Everyone's talking about the combination uh, of the Prism River Sisters combining into one unit. Now, Sunny Milk has the idea to do the same thing with Luna, Star, and herself into one unit.
Valor mm, or Hot Blood. What? <laughs> Even the sister gets yelled? Wow. Interesting. Well, the conditions changed again for defeat. The victory is still the same, but defeat is that everyone must die now, so it's okay. Here's the thing. Um, with the free the fairies, they can you can separate them at will as well, but you can recombine them if you want. And all three of them have. The, uh, let's just take a look. If they combine into one unit, they have regeneration by 10%. They have the sunny barrier, and they can split apart each. They can uh, decombine. Uh, okay, their terrain. Uh, they just took the best parts of what they have, I guess. So, sky and night is good. Bad ground and water is bad. Their size medium now. Their armor is still bad. Their mobility is okay-ish, but they cost 4.5. If you add them all up together, it might be more though. But yeah. And who takes the skills? It's only the leader. That'll be Sunny. Luna and Star, they don't matter, so yeah. And their attacks? They're all different. You can not uh, Okay, yeah. This one costs the most, but they're all different mostly. Yeah, they only have Floor this round. The bad point is that you have to take out the Free Fairies each time you want to combine them into one in every map after this chapter. Or rather, in any other chapter you want to use them, so yes. Okay, let's do a save first. Let's take a look at their other move right now. mistake one two three four five six seven all right so sun milk and fire this one from there okay shall I she'll get the kill but she has luck might as well Not yet. That is the right move, right? I gotta check it out. Yeah, it is. Okay, good. painful continue on the map then let's see fancy seal yeah they're not dead good enough
Yeah, Shil can only cast one lock before I had cast Invincible, so no. Just cast Shil's move and then I'm done. Although I have a feeling we'll miss, but eh, whatever. Okay, the Free Sisters, Donwaku Barrier. I'm thinking that they can't suffer any stats effects that we have, that we put onto them. That's what I'm thinking. Rain blind spot around two. So yeah. Okay. That really hurts. Sock is useless because I can't get uh, I can't get Sakya's world inside quickly. Komachi, on the other hand, maybe I could squeeze in. Yeah, I could squeeze in one move. Ko skip. Range is seven, right? Oh, six only. Oh, okay. Still a blind spot. Oh well. Real. Of all things, you want to shoot me right now? Okay. The move that the Prison Rivers, uh, the Sister State did at once, is a reference to Aquarion, uh, one of its attacks. If you like the anime for Aquarion, uh, then you might like the attacks as well. They also have the pilots when they combine together into one unit, they have this orgasmatic scene somewhat. <laughs> it's quite hilarious to be honest. Uh, and also, their, th oh, their theme when they're together is also a reference to their second opening theme of Aquarion. I'll post uh, the links in the descriptions below as usual. But yeah, it's a kicker when you see that. Although it would be hilarious if the Prison River Sisters did an orgasmatic scene when they combined into one. That would be hilarious. But that's my opinion. But oh well. Let's see, Sunny Milk and attack now. Alright, sure hit. And flash. Give it to... Should I give it to Rima? Yeah, give it to Reimu. Last spell card for this person, so yeah.
for this attack that the Free Fairies did, it's a reference to the anime Dragona. It's basically a reference to one of their attacks with the light, the light beam cannon attack. It's the combination attack. I'll show you in the description. I'll show you the links in the description below again. Other than that, uh, let's see. Anything else? Uh, will we be able to use these attacks later on? I hope so. But I guess not, since we are on a time limit. So, yeah, might as well finish the stage as usual. Oh, yeah, that's right. Give. Suzuha, give the. Inspired to. Momiji. Yep. Yeah. Maybe we should kill this round. Thirty two thousand points. And Miko level 5. Great. Now all your characters are at the door right now, as you see here. And Raymond removes the barrier to the netherworld, or rather... What was it called again? I forgot. Mm, can't remember the name, but I'll remember later on. Wait, reinforcements? We're in a bad spot now again. So it's a preview to next chapters, huh? Alright. So we had to deal with Ren and Chin. Well, that was quick. Now, let's see. Eh, looks fine here. Okay. Well, that ends chapter 30 today. So, until next time. We will see each other again at chapter 31 then. See you next time.